Welcome to Nuts and Bolts Before You Call Edition. In this series, we cover little issues that can easily be addressed before you call a technician. Let's get to it. Today's topic is about the washing machine. If the washer isn't functioning properly, there are a few quick and easy things you can try to get this appliance back up and running. If you find water puddles on the floor, check the washer's hose connections. If they're loose, you will want to snug them up until the leak stops. Check the actual valves as well. You may be able to tighten the packing nut clockwise on the supply valve to slow or even stop the leak. Also, examine the hoses. Use a paper towel to run down the length of each hose. If you find any water or the hose appears to have small splits or bubbles, replace it immediately. Next, check the fittings for leaks. You can replace the rubber washer if needed. If you find soapy puddles on the floor, be certain that you're using high efficiency detergent. It's formulated to be used in lower levels of water. Front loading machines have a small overflow system usually on the back of the appliance. If you have too many suds, this is likely where the suds are coming from. If you're still encountering issues with your washer, it can be a sign of an internal problem which may require some disassembly or a professional's diagnosis. But by doing a little troubleshooting yourself before you make that call can save you time and some money. I hope this information helps. Please like and share this knowledge with others and let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Thank you.